setting grid snapping. To set the snapping between the visible grids in the viewports. So we want these grid lines. If we want to set these grid lines. We need to go up to tools. So we're in the up here in our tools. And then in tools, we come all the way down to grid snaps. And then we go to grid snap settings. In our grid snap settings dialog box, grid and snap settings dialog box, we want to go to our home grid. So I go to the home grid. And so the default grid in 3ds Mac is known as our home grid. Where it says grid spacing, this is the value between each of our grid lines. All right, this is the uh, spacing the uh, to specify the size of the smallest square of the grid. And this is for the uh, right now. This is for this one right here that I have selected. Then the major lines, every nth grid line. So a lot of times on graph paper, we'll have perhaps 10 squares. And on the 10th square, we might have a thicker, larger line that's known as a major line. We might want to have that a thicker line. So I could set this to every 100, for example. So a lot of times the values are 1 and 5 or 1 and 10, things of that nature where X amount of grids are a little thicker. So you can count easier. Then in the perspective view, like this one here is our perspective view, we have in this case um, our perspective view grid extents. And this is to specify the size of the home grid in the viewport, uh, perspective viewport. If we come down here to dynamic update, right now we have the active viewports selecting so these settings are for this viewport okay I can change them with each viewports but if I set it to be all viewports these settings then are applied to all of my viewports in the scene so we want to set our grid spacings to something that that is going to work for us on that particular scene or project so once again to get to our grid spacing uh, settings, we want to go up to tools. We want to go down the grid and snaps, the grid snap settings. And we want to go to the home grid and set our grid dimensions and our dynamic update.